This is the brand new iPhone 13 and we can't seem to get it to break. And today's the day. It is the official iPhone drop right now, 7 a.m. And a lot of planning has gone into this, but we are set to be some of the first people to grab the iPhone 13. With that privilege, we are going to throw it onto the ground from as high as we can while flying the Sky Surfer aircraft. So this will be an interesting day. We were even up last night doing the second flight ever with the new power system. I actually haven't told Andrew yet what we're doing. All he knows is that we're going to the iPhone store. We're actually gonna throw it off of the sky surfer. Like, is it gonna survive? Is it gonna survive? I don't know. That's what we're doing with our privilege of being some of the first, but we're kinda late, so we're gonna run. It is 8 a.m. and we are in traffic headed to the Apple store to pick up our iPhone 13. The store we're headed to is in Santa Monica. I guess there's a lot of people out there trying to smash iPhones right now because we can't find parking, so we're driving around the block. I think we have to walk a mile to get there and we are way behind schedule but let's go hopefully they saved our iphone look at that line in there it's like wrapped through the store you're free to go ahead though yeah congratulations <laughs> she goes congratulations i feel like this is an experience right now <laughs> this line's an experience congratulations <laughs> look at the line congratulations you just spent one thousand dollars <laughs> I'm stoked for that. Like I said, I think I'm more excited to throw this thing than I am to actually have like a new iPhone 13. You're gonna throw the, so you're going skydiving and you're gonna just drop them? Well, it's like a flying snowboarding, so I'm gonna take these up on it and we're gonna toss them off of it. Well, do you think they're gonna be able to withstand the fall? I wanna actually put this case on right now and toss this phone around on the ground and see what people say. Check this out. Whoa. <laughs> Ouch. <laughs> <laughs> It hurts so bad. <laughs> this is so wrong. It is so wrong. <laughs> There's all these people waiting in line to get one of these. And here you are dropping it on the ground <laughs> right in front of them. <laughs> We're going to be throwing these out of the sky. Drop them and see if they are straight on Do you think they're going to survive? I don't know. in a case. I've seen some phones really survive, you know, all sorts of things. So it is quite possible. I mean, with the case, it should. I'm excited that you're doing that the new 13 you're gonna destroy. This is the brand new 13. Oh, wow. And it, it literally feels so wrong, but... Oh my god. <laughs> All right, it's still alive. It's alive. <laughs> so, it made it. Yeah. Have you guys ever seen the hoverboard aircraft flying yeah. on the internet? Yeah. yeah, so that's me. Oh, so oh yeah, cool. Oh, wow, oh, that thing it like, goes through the desert. Okay, I've seen that. That's so cool. Yeah, we so said so that cool. the other day, yeah. That's, that's scary as shit. <laughs> this is scary. I don't want it to get sucked into the propellers, you know what I mean? Oh my gosh. That's sick. Yeah, so do you think it'll survive? Ooh, I don't know. No. How high are you gonna go? Because you're pretty high. Yeah. At least like two stories higher. Do I toss it? Oh my god. <laughs> I, I feel bad. I feel terrible too. Up it. On the ground? Oh my god. Oh! That felt so wrong. My whole body just tensed up. Oh. And nothing? Nothing. Nothing. Yeah, for sure. Let's go. <laughs> You're such a clumsy guy, Hunter. You guys not, they're like, that was a good start to your uh, brand new iPhone. <laughs> Let's go home and test these things out. Woo. Check it out, the iPhone 13. It's not even fair. There you go, it's man. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> no. You weren't supposed to no. save it. <laughs> okay, hold up. Can we look at that on replay for a second? I had it like this. <laughs> no. It's too good. <laughs> Pockets of baseball. <laughs> oh, <laughs> trying so hard. Now I caught it that time. Yeah. Right. Anyways, we're gonna go throw it out of this guy. Oh yeah. my gosh, I don't. I have a banana peel in my hand. Oh, right. I don't want to touch. Oh, no. <gasps> what? oh my gosh. Oh. Is it cracked? No. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Wait, that's the 13th. You think it's gonna survive? Can I drop it? Yeah, sure. <laughs> Sounds like it. So the goal is not to break it because then I get to keep it and I'll have an iPhone 13. You can drop it on the grass, right? Well, I'm going to be chucking it through the sky down into oh, the tennis court. I don't court. want to hear that. Oh, hard. I'll try not to hit you with this. This last one yep. is going to go all the way from the top of there and I'm going to throw it left-handed somehow all the way over down this 10-foot wall into this tennis court and it's because it might be all over the place. So before I do this, I'm replacing two cracked propellers on this thing and uh, yeah, reason for that is I'm going pretty high so I want to make sure nothing goes wrong but I mean the cracks are on the tips of the propellers it's not the end of the world if I'm flying low, but yeah, I think I'm gonna do new props. I already put the screen protector on. I did a horrible job with it. There's so many bubbles and a lot of dirt underneath it, so it's probably not doing much except making it worse, but hey. We're gonna do this in three different levels. The first one's gonna be right here. It's gonna be about eight feet. 
The second one is gonna be the same eight feet, but I'm gonna throw it another 10 foot drop over into the tennis court. And the third, I'm gonna go up onto the roof and we're gonna calculate that distance later because it's pretty tall up there. Film's better now, actually. Test number two, 15 feet. Let's go. Oh my god. Is it working? Yes, it's working. Look at this. Whoa. So, remember when I said we were even up last night doing the second flight ever with the new power system. This power system has been in development for six months now, and last night I set a record hovering for at least 25 minutes, which is pretty insane, and well, I burned up all the motors, and discovered today it's not safe to fly. We kept throwing the phone around trying to break it, and surprisingly it survived everything, but no doubt we will find a way to break it. Here we are two weeks later with a new sky server. A lot happened in between. More on that later. I found 13 drop tests from 20 feet inside a mouse case in three, two, one. Oh my god! Let's go! No scratches at all? But I'm on a mission to destroy this phone any way possible. We've tossed it a handful of times right now and it's still fully functional, so I'm gonna do it the old fashioned way and manually climb this tower. <laughs> This is not looking good, y'all. He is way up there. That looks really scary. I don't know if he's gonna be able to do this. I mean, look at him. He's all the way up there right now. Oh my gosh. And that's the first challenge. Next challenge, he has to throw the phone off. Ding! All right, there's Hunter. He's really gonna throw a phone from there all the way to here. That's a long throw. Oh my gosh. Let's see if he can do it. Wait, let's see. Let's see. Wait, dude. It's, what? Oh my gosh. He's all the way up there. Did it survive? Of course it survived. Bizarre. No freaking way. The phone's cracked. <laughs> Thanks for checking out this video. Subscribe to check out more crazy videos on this channel and watch the development of the Sky Surfer aircraft. Woo!